hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i am going to be showing you a very detailed tutorial on how you can make your frontal for your knotless braids and for this lace frontal i got it just this way from my beauty supply store and then i am sewing it down on the wig cap and i like to sew mine twice so if you guys want to see a very detailed tutorial on how to lay your lace front i'll just drop comments down below and i'm going to make a video on that so guys you want to stick around because i'm going to be showing you people the skills how i got to achieve it and how long it took me to make this wig i'll be telling you guys everything and if you haven't still subscribed to the channel please hit the subscribe button give the video thumbs up and drop comments if you have any questions and for all my returning subscriber always coming around to watch my videos thank you all so so much so just keep watching so the next thing you want to do is to go ahead to draw out the hairline so you're not going to be ventilating out of the hairline then i'll just go ahead with my powder and just blend it together so that i would be able to see through the net holes and then i went in with the measuring tape just to outline it so i was using one inch this is just to just give me an idea on how i am going to you know ventilate the braiding hair through the lace net hole so you want to go ahead to just outline it so i'm just doing like um a rough sketch on that and so far this is what i have done this thing you want to do is to use t pins to secure the frontal lace net just so that you could have a flat surface having a flat surface is going to help you when you're ventilating and this is the ventilating pin and also a crochet needle but for me i prefer to use the crochet pin because it works better with me and then i'm going to be making a box and i do three lines each and i try as much as i can to follow the line pattern so that the boxes could come out equal so i'm going to ve be ventilating the first line then after the first line i will do the second and the third and then i will go to the other side just to create the boxes so you will just keep watching and see what i'm doing <music> the outer lines you would do I do two strands of braiding hair then when I'm ventilating inside I do three to four to five strands of braiding hair and also like you guys saw I like to pull the hair so that I could actually see if I am having a very very straight line and to make this frontal it took me about two weeks to do this
creating the boxes three lines each I just like to pull the front line to the back to see if I could see through the net and if I notice that I could really really see through the net I will just open up the box and I will begin to crochet inside the boxes so earlier on i actually showed you guys the ventilating pin and the crochet pin i am using now so for some people who can use the ventilating pin that's fine but with me i tried using it and i was really slow at using it so i just went back to use this very small crochet pin but with this very small crochet pin if you're not careful it has a way of always tearing your net for the ventilating pin i have not used it so i really don't know if using it is going to tear the net so if you've used it before and it tore the net or it did not just drop comments down let us know my next video will be on a tutorial on what I use the frontal for so if you haven't still subscribed to the channel you want to go ahead to subscribe and turn on your post notification bell so that you will not get to miss that upload so this is it guys for this video I hope you enjoyed it thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one